Community building during a crisis is very critically important to understand. A stitch in time saves nine and thousands of volunteers are representing this stitch in India by going out of their way to help the poor and those putting themselves on the front line of this battle against the coronavirus. Friends, obviously, they are not only saving lives but also contributing to a great growing community which is setting an example for the rest of the world. Friends, in times like these, such communities play a major role in instilling hope and belief in humanity. It could be your absolutely local neighborhood or a countrywide community. All of them contribute equally to this great country called India and its culture. Friends, immigrant worker camps were established. When the lockdown was announced, the first to be affected were laborers and daily wage earners who immediately proceeded on foot to try and reach their native villages because they could not afford to sustain themselves in cities. But with local governments quickly closing borders, they had to be directed to relief camps. Thankfully, the authorities decided to come to the rescue. Apparently, there are some 28,000 camps set up for them currently by the different state governments in India and that was a big support. Facebook communities were established. There are hundreds of such communities on Facebook which are calling for volunteers to distribute food and masks as well as to spread awareness about how to maintain social distancing and personal hygiene during the pandemic. Friends, the middle class looking at the plight of the poor, India's growing middle class has also come to the rescue. From distributing food packets to donating money, from paying maids and drivers even when they are not working, to setting up temporary kitchens to feed the needy, the list of their good deeds is absolutely endless. Friends, even small and private companies supported. Even small and medium companies tried to fill in the gaps left by the authorities who were themselves actually running helter-skelter to ensure that essentials and medicines were available at every Kirana and medical store in the country of India. This has been the biggest boon in the lockdown of people coming together. Ineligible poor were also there. Though the government is trying to help those who have registered themselves, there are many who don't have any documentation to avail of the money or the meals that the government is providing. And that is where people have stepped in to help. Friends, there is still a lot that can be done and we can take a cue from happenings absolutely around the world. Even in our local community, we can do a lot for those in need. Friends, volunteer to go to the grocery for those who cannot leave their homes, especially the elderly and the handicapped. Use social media to share ideas on how to cope up with the social isolation or job losses. Retired doctors or nurses can provide valuable guidance to their local communities. Teachers can share study plans and advice on how to go about homeschooling children in local communities. In fact, in some communities, children are writing and communicating through emails with the elderly who are either stuck alone at home or in old age homes. Friends, restaurants and hotels are worth it. So find out how you can help them to survive, perhaps through home delivery of meals or by buying gift cards from them which can be used to buy meals in the future. This can be a very good temporary solution for them. Friends, there are many more ways in which we can contribute to our community. Share your ideas on social media and let all get together to pay and take it forward. St. Angelo's VNCT Ventures is one of the largest villa developers in India. Brings to you the White Villas Shahapur. The Suzanne Khan designed villas comes with land ownership, 360 degree lush green view, very near from Mumbai and Thane, 3 kilometers away from Adgao local railway station, 500 meters away from Mumbai Nasik Highway, assured rentals with zero maintenance, high capital appreciation expected in coming years, world class materials with best amenities. So grab the opportunity and do your villa booking today. Call us on 9011 or visit us on www.savvglobal.com. 
St. Angelo's VNCT Ventures is one of the largest villa developers in India. Brings to you the White Villas Kasara. Designer Villas comes with land ownership, 360 degree lush green view, very near from Mumbai and Thane, 1.2 kilometers away from Kasara local railway station, adjoining to Mumbai Nasik Highway. Assured rentals with zero maintenance. High capital appreciation expected in coming years on this road. 20 feet double height living room. World class materials with best amenities. So grab the opportunity and do your villa booking today. Call us on 9011-223344 or visit us on www.savvglobal.com.